and assalamu alaikum so this video is just a short demonstration of how i cover up all this and this especially this because this is my bad side this is the side i break the most on and this one is a well behaved one although there's a few but trust me it's nothing compared to what's going on here you see all this in fact there's a new one you see it gross but yeah so this is the first thing i do actually is i go in with the moisturizer and this is the one i'm currently using the nivea light moisturizing day cream it seems to be working just like that and i just go straight in all over the face i also have the what is it called I also have this one by perfect and radiant and this one is so oily it's very oily so I'm trying to avoid that one by all means and I only use it when my skin is really dry and then what I go in next with is a primer which I think for me is a must since I wear makeup because my skin is so bad like I crease like nobody's business so I tried to go in with a primer because I need this thing to not crease on me, especially on my smile lines. Hey, my tat, about to my tat. So I just go in with this much, and I just go in my T zone, just where I need it the most. So foundation, I'm using the Revlon color stay foundation and i'm using this only because i've burned i've turned up way too much like you can see i don't know if you can see the difference but my scarf ends here and my tat and you can see the lightness there it's actually in khadi too so i'm going in with this one because it's just close to my skin tone right now and this one anyway it light it lighted too much so i use this one to highlight instead so i'm gonna go with two pumps on my brush this brush it's a flat top brush two full pumps i try and focus it where i need it the most especially these two areas you see that and it also oxidizes so don't worry it's gonna blend in just nicely Some days I think this one is too orange for me, but the wig is shade and cutting, but um, I just feel like, you know what? It's just perfect because when I get all burned by the sun, it's getting not orange. I don't know why. I mean, look at this. Anyways, I don't know. It's just part of the burning process, I guess. If I'm not happy, I always go in with the second layer just on parts where I feel like, you know what, I need more coverage. Like, if this wasn't this much covered, I was going to go in with a tiny bit more. And also this side, which I think I do need, but you know what, I'm not going to go in because I don't want to be a cake face. I'm just trying to go very minimum at this point, so, yeah. Minimum. Now I'm going to go in with my lighter foundation, which I use for highlight. Which is just under my eyes i don't go anywhere else with it because listen listen okay listen nobody needs all this on their face but the weather is good so this is just to highlight um my under eyes because guys i have bags okay dark under eye circles no no and then also i just put it on my eyelid just to kind of blend it in and i'm making this video because honali a few ladies who are like can you please show us how you do that i'm struggling i'm this i'm that and i'm like you know girl i got you i got you i don't know what i'm doing because i'm not an expert but listen let's be crazy together okay hey i look like a ghost oh god <laughs> 
It's all gonna come together, trust me. Doesn't look that bad. Also on the chin, nyanagada. And then uh, let me just wipe my hands because <laughs> bruh, it don't look good. I'm gonna go in with my sponge. It's lama at the moment, so yeah. Just go in and blend everything out. So I'm just gonna blend, blend, blend until it's all in the skin. And then the next thing I go in with get powder. And I use the same powder. This one, the same like a foundation. Oh my god. And I'm just going to set my under eyes. Also my eyelids because listen, nobody wants creasing. I don't. And then I'm gonna try and also touch up my whole face. Just so that all this shiny shiny goes away because anybody got time for that? Do you see how flawless flawless the skin is looking? And this is not even a lot of product. You can just leave it here, but listen, you don't want to look dead. So let me know bronze nyana here and dara pieces. So I think that's it. I'm gonna go in with my bronzer powder thingy and just put a bit of color in the skin because I'm looking all kinds of dead right now. You can use any powder as long as it's two shades darker than your skin tone because the one I'm using here is just something I got from a friend so you don't even need to see it because trust me <laughs> you don't need to see it. I'm gonna go in on my under my cheekbones just over there just on my cheekbone and then pull it up like this you know just to put a bit of color in there and I don't even call this contouring I call it bronzing I just wish I had a right shade because this is too orange But it does do something, you know. It does do something. Some days I feel like, yes, this thing is not dark enough for me. Not two shades lighter or... But actually, it does do something. I'm just being... Bleh. And then also on my forehead. I cannot partly do now, but come on. I do need a bit of something there, right? I see most they do this, so let me also do what they do. <laughs> I'm just doing what people are doing. The professionals and the what what's the gurus they run it through the forehead and they say it's for when you have a big forehead it kind of makes it look smaller like it's an illusion or something listen i don't know anything i'm just going with the flow so you also just go with the flow yeah looks nice and then just go with the flow because we are just going with the flow also we are also just going with the flow so nose contour i never do this but i tried it last time and i was happy so i'm gonna take this tiny brush dip it in the product and then just run it on the sides of my nose let me use a mirror run it on the sides of my nose like this just right there up and down up and down do the same on the other side It doesn't show ne, but <laughs> trust me it makes a difference because i actually feel like you know what it does make my nose look like it's slim and also like it's straight i don't have a straight nose by the way i have a fat nose and i think i have a fat nose but whatever let's just carry on okay and then i take it to my eyelid just under the eyes i mean just under the brow just to you know join it like it's going along with the brown with the brow but whatever I don't think I need highlight you know because look at my nose my nose is glowing hey what's up where are you glowing to to sang I think that's it 
um yeah so next i'm gonna go in with my blush usual the usual the usual nothing special in fact it even broke but i'm not gonna buy a new one okay i'm gonna use this thing until it finishes uh-uh i'm not uh, listen people out here they're buying seven found they own seven foundations seven powders hey how many what what i don't need that okay i just need one of each please do you see that pinky pinky anyways let's go with the program and then i like to pull it to the sides here just slightly i want to buy a new um powder a kind of orangey or burgundy is it burgundy purplish just for you know different shade of blushes because i only have this pink one and i don't think i always i don't always like being pink sometimes i want to be gray you know blue so maybe i should get one of those shades <laughs> oh this is crazy <laughs> okay and sometimes i run it down my nose just to you know look all kinds of cute i look like a telly no not a telly tubby what are these puppies that have these pink cheeks and stuff well i look like them and i'm, I'm cute <sighs> okay done with the face i'm trying to figure out if i should highlight or not but listen on an everyday kind of makeup you wouldn't highlight would you so i think i'm gonna skip no i'm not gonna skip hell no i'm gonna go in for the glow so i'm gonna use the same brush i used to contour the nose you know and everything and i'm just gonna rub it i'm just gonna you know yes okay let me start on the nose because Hey, it's too sharp. <laughs> okay, Amira, calm down. You, what's going on? <laughs> hey, and you know, this is too much. Try this side as well. This brush is not doing it, man. This brush is not doing anything for me. Come on. Where's the glow? I know this highlighter is popping. Now, why are you playing with me? Look, are you for real? Yes, Mama Sita, that's more like it. Yes, says Kopotamo. Come, let's fix this side as well. Yes, get a give one got your red say ever tune. This tiny brush was just doing me like yeah. Looking like a million dollars. Looking like a million dollars. Okay, I'm just kidding. Nobody's looking like a million dollar here. Don't look like me. Million dollar. Anyways. Whew, this nose is too sharp. Hey, I'm going to Hey, I'm here. Okay, you know what? Not bad. I need to do the brows, which is a struggle, to be real. I usually go in with a oh, this lady just came to coffee of all places she had to come and coffee when i'm busy recording so, so. eyelashes done this mascara is so heavy you can feel it on your lashes like it's dragging them down but that's lashes done um i was gonna put falsies but me and falsies no 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 i'm good and this is the finished look um you can see all the blemishes the pimples bye same on this side the worst one so that's it guys this is how i cover up my face and this is the most minimum i've been well actually not minimum because i did throw on some highlight but without the highlighter it was going to be a very very minimum kind of look and also without the lipstick i should have just left the highlight and the lipstick and just gone for labello and i was gonna be like yes but this is just a quick kind of makeup look and also stressless look so 
thank you guys so much for tuning in and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and other than that i will see you guys on my i will see you guys on my next video assalamualaikum